And now, and now I'm gonna do my clap sync. Uh, that wasn't meaty enough. Hey Google, turn my light off. <laughs> hey Google, what does goblinoid mean? <laughs> Some creature that resembles a goblin. And a human at the exact same time. <laughs> whack, right? <laughs> wiggity wiggity whack, dog. Hey Google, turn my light off. It didn't hear me before. Hey did Google, hear me did again? we start our did we start the episode of Uncharted? Hey Google, turn my light off. There we go. I had to wait for the lights to turn on. There we go. That's Fucking crazy. Christ. Dude. I'll go back to, to Uncharted one. When we last left off, we were going insane. <laughs> because we weren't funny. Yeah. Whoa. Yeah. Oh, you, okay, um, you, you know I gotta do it. I gotta do the... <laughs> yeah! <laughs> yeah. Wow. Woo! So, a while back, like, earlier this week, um, I, was I, was, I was having a conversation with you, Benson. Oh, yeah? And, uh, um, basically, it was, it was the classic, uh, me randomly asking, like, a question, and... <laughs> like it like not having an answer or like a joke to kind of bang off of yeah uh so it was basically the question was uh what fictional character has uh the most porn on the internet uh, oh yeah the, these i i intentionally was like okay i'm not gonna i'm not gonna say uh what this uh reddit po post's conclusion was on who has the most porn um but yeah, like a lot of the uh, a lot of the uh, posts were like M Mercy from Overwatch, few Overwatch characters. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, Gardevoir for some reason, the Pokemon. Um, another one was like Jessica Rabbit from you know Who Framed Roger Rabbit, which fair enough. She has, um, she has she has the she has the the hips of a, dude. Those hips don't lie. A, a, she has the hips of a train. <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't say train immediately. <laughs> they they oh make God. train noises. <laughs> they're, they're just like boom. <laughs> you know. <laughs> Lois. Gr my my favorite comment on this thread is Lois Griffin seems to get a lot of action. <laughs> So someone, someone on the Reddit post uh, was like, uh, "Quick search of Rule 34: Gardevoir has 6,500 and two. Uh, Diva from Overwatch has 6,317. Mercy has 5,937. Uh, Bowser, and then in quotations, including Bowsette, I assume. <laughs> and here is the the apparent the, the clear winner." Uh, of this, uh, of this, uh, who has the most, uh, porn, or which fictional character has the most porn. Apparently it's Twilight Sparkles with 15,000 and 24. 15k. 15,024. What? That Bronies, man. I don't... <laughs> Uh, Get Fandom posted uh, two minutes ago saying, Vin Diesel won't spoil whether Fast and the Furious is heading to space. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, you know, I, I yeah. feel like you would definitely know this because you are a Metal Gear fan, but like the, vo the voice actor for Solid Snake wrote X2. Like, yes, I knew that. Yeah. That's fucking he also crazy wrote, to me. Uh, he also wrote, he also had a hand in writing uh, X-Men Origins, Wolverine. Yes! Yeah! <laughs> he, he's, he's partially responsible for uh, weird Deadpool. Dude, I think I'm like the only person in existence that will, that can stomach that movie. Uh, really? Yeah, like... I don't know, man. I, like, I I like that movie because I liked it as a kid and I watched it so much as a kid. To, to the point where, like, I have such a skewed version of it in my head. <laughs> like, I haven't seen it 
in years, but I would happily go back and watch that Wait, movie. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. No, 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 no. I'm wrong. Sorry. Um, so, it wasn't written. I'm pretty sure David Hayter has a cameo in uh, Wolverine or X-Men Origins. Ah. Um, but one of the screenplay writers was David Benioff from... Uh, if you don't know, or if people don't know, that is one of the main showrunners and writers for Game of Thrones. <laughs> Which, <laughs> like, <laughs> I just want to throw it out there. People should have expected this. People should have expected this of Game of Thrones. I've been saying it for years, ever since I found out that David Benioff wrote X-Men Origins Wolverine, that he cannot write on his own. He needs source material to adapt, and yeah. even then it's like a toss of the dice. Dude, I would love, I would fucking love to write, like some bullshit fantasy thing like even like i don't even like fantasy that much mm. i'm aware i always am i did not see that epic nathan drake funny haha hey we're on chapter 14 nathan, nathan drake get concussion die <laughs> What if he just, like, passed out, and this is a dream, and, like, his body fell in between the door that rose up, so it crushed him going <laughs> up? I, th th this is a better recording session than the last. Can I just say that? <laughs> like, right yeah, out? Yeah, way, way better. <laughs> like, in general. <laughs> Nathan Drake, just be like... <laughs> <laughs> Dude, imagine... Like, okay, just, you're, you're, you're some goons, just gooning around, being goons, you know, not, you're, like, you're, you're, you're contract to kill this guy, and then you, you walk out in front and some guy's behind you, and you fucking, you get collated by this guy in, like, a tan shirt with, like, overalls, or whatever the fuck, like, what's this yeah. satchel backpack thing that holsters guns, what is I that? It's a holster. I mean, uh, like, okay, okay, you you want up me on that one? That's some good game design right there. The light showed me where to go. That was fucking sick. You see that? <laughs> you see that shit? That's great game design. Oh my <laughs> god. Ugh. Oh, that's crazy. I know, oh, dude. Fuck game design. What? <laughs> Society. Um. <laughs> Dude, I love society, dude. It's so good. Yeah, totally, dude. You're about to get, like, shot in the head. Nah, but if I keep dipping in and out of cover, they won't shoot me, dude. I'm a fucking genius. If you keep dipping? Dude, you if can't I, double dude, dip. <laughs> dude, I know I can't double dip, but I'm Nathan Drake. I don't give a fuck, dude. <laughs> dude, Nathan Drake would probably find, like, 30-year-old dip and <laughs> just double dip. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm, I love that dip, you know? That dip. Not, not tobacco, though. We, we, we only, only queso. <laughs> only some of that, some of that good salsa. I don't like salsa. I, I just don't like spicy yeah, things. Well, salsa isn't, like, spicy. Well, like, I'm a white person, so anything spicy to me. I'm, like, half white, and I love spicy things. Yeah, but that's because you're half white. You know, you you got something else in you. <laughs> yeah, that other is Eldridge being, and they don't like spicy is there things. A guy behind me. There's a fucking guy behind me with a shotgun, isn't there? <laughs> that wouldn't there's be a, a quote. That's not a quote that normally happens when you're in a firefight. There's a guy behind me. There's a guy <laughs> shooting me with a shotgun. It's not a. That's not a quote that you normally get to say. Well, the, you, well, okay. What if it's like a firefight and like, uh, <laughs> in uh, in like an airsoft match or a paintball match? You know, like, 
like an airsoft well, match. Then, well, then, like, there, then there's the context of well, it's an airsoft match. This is yeah, just like true. real guns. <laughs> This is real guns. Yo, there's a guy behind me with a shotgun, isn't there? He's just shooting. He's like, what? You're not dying. What? They're like, <laughs> the, the main guy's just like, have you got my thyroid medication? <laughs> and then the other guy's like, no, I do not have your thyroid medication. Drake's like, what the fuck? Dude, we need to watch Kung Pao sometime. I think you'd fucking love that movie if you, if you haven't seen it already. I have not seen it. Oh my god. Do you want to know, like, what it is? Sure. Okay, so, Steve Odekirk, uh, the guy that founded the company that made Jimmy Neutron and fucking Barnyard and shit, uh -huh. uh, and, like, did all the thumb movies where he just did parodies of actual movies but with thumbs, he fucking, he took this old, like, this terrible old, uh, like, kung fu movie and superimposed him as the main guy on to the onto this onto the main guy's like 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 the whole like movie is just like a super dumb abridged of the movie but like it's live action and it's so good that's that's almost as dumb as the movie paul uh what's i forget is it so seth rogan yeah. He plays a gray alien. I fucking rem Okay, I was like, is that the alien movie in my head? But I didn't want to sound like an idiot. Yeah. I haven't seen <laughs> yeah. that movie, but I, I know about its existence slightly oh, from growing up. I, I, I had to watch it a couple times because I didn't... I, I, like, I thought it was funny, but I wasn't sure. <laughs> <laughs> Dude. Ugh. That's how I feel about funny man all the time. But like <laughs> I keep subjecting myself to it because it's funny itself. Just just watching that movie and over and over again is like oh my god. Yeah. The idea of someone watching that movie more than once is funny. And that's why I am that person. <laughs> so I... nobody else has to be. <laughs> like Oh fuck. I feel like I have to watch like I feel like I have to write uh like an essay, like a video essay on <laughs> a video it. Video essay on Funny Man. And See, the why thing is, when like... I when I inevitably go to like film school, I'm gonna be the one guy. It's just like, have you seen Funny Man? <laughs> <laughs> like this super fucking dumbass 1994 movie B movie with Christopher Lee in it. B movie. It's a C movie, dude. It's, it's not. A C, it's <laughs> well, it's got Christopher Lee, so I'd, I'd say it's a B movie. You know, I, right? I mean, it's 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 not a B movie in the same way like The Howling Two is a B movie because there are mm. there are genuinely like really good sequences in that, but uh, I cannot say that about uh, Funny Man. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I don't know. I think I'm more susceptible to liking action than I am about like specific comedy. Huh. Because like I like Funny Man. It's, it's a good movie. Um, it's just I I think I feel like I'm. I feel like if you make like a really interesting and really good action sequence, I'm gonna enjoy it a bit more. Yeah. Like your movie can like like their story can like blow chunks, and kind of be like the weirdest dialogue on earth. Yeah. But like. You know, if you have, like, really cool action sequences, it's like, something on par with, like, John Wick, it's like, oh, this is decent, because most yeah. of John Wick is, like, action sequences. Oh, no, the whole movie is action sequences. It's one big action sequence. I haven't seen John Wick, but I know it's good. Yeah. Because there wouldn't, there wouldn't be, like, a fifth one coming out or whatever. <laughs> Dude, like... Fucking Keanu Reeves has said, and, and the director has said, "Hey, if you guys want more, we'll just make more." Like, well, like yeah. they'll, they're willing to do that till the end of time, and I respect those fucking men for for doing that shit. Because it's like you're like, filming seems like hell. Like just yeah. in general, you're like doing all this shit, and it just I don't know. 
Cause yeah, that that's why I like I was kind of like I'm kind of hesitant about like going into film as a career. Yeah, because it it just takes up so much time and it's takes up so like, much a lot time. Of life. Yeah. Yeah. Like um, fucking yeah. Yeah, you gotta work like hellish hours. You gotta be like, if you're an actor, you gotta be fucking on t- like a hundred every single time you're on screen. There's like. But, oh my, it's insane how many, like, that people do that. Yeah. Like, just, like, watching, uh, it's Jim and Andy or whatever, like, uh, Jim and Andy, the the documentary that uh, Jim Carrey did because he played uh, fucking Andy Kaufman. Like, that shit's fucking crazy. He went insane. He lost himself doing playing that role. Yeah. Actors have a hard job. Like everyone on set has a, like a hard job. Oh yeah, like but uh, let me just like, get up and close my door quickly. Like a gaffer guy, they they have to make sure that the cords are all safe for everyone, dude. That's fucking hard. Yeah. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, <laughs> that that sounded like I was shitting on them. Like I, honestly, no, 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 like no. it's it's I was I'm just goofing. But like, still, it, it is. I do respect those people. Like, I respect everyone mm-hmm. in the film industry. Like, behind the scenes, and like yeah. on screen and all that shit. Like, it's insane. Uh, like, like I've done. Like, surprisingly, the one job that I have not been subjected to is directing. Oh yeah. Um, and like, I've I've had people who have done. Like, like not like official directing, but like short film directing. Yeah. And it's like, it's interesting, but it's also like, you know, kind of. <laughs> yeah, I've I've seen some like really really talent. Like, when I was like going on work experience, uh, with my school, mm. um, I I went to. Uh, just a like a a post secondary int- institution that was like, mm-hmm. yeah, we're gonna put this is a film set and we're gonna act like it's a film set. And I'm like, huh. It was pretty nuts. <laughs> I have nowhere. I have no idea where to go. By the way, I have. Yeah, I, I can. I can. Ve- tell. I am very lost. I'd, I'd love to get into animation shit. Like, just being, like, a cleanup artist, honestly. Because, like, I don't, know, I don't know about being a storyboard artist and, like, doing that shit. Yeah, that's profession. hard. Like, that's hard as shit. Because you gotta, like, I mean, come you have up a, with you have, a, like, a pretty decent... Shit. Like, not, like, a crazy good, but, like, you have a decent portfolio. <laughs> Do I? <laughs> I mean, from the animation that I've seen from you, that is pretty good. The it's like animation, but you. <laughs> the I, one animation. Well, I, mean, <laughs> like... I, I mean, I saw you storyboard for the yeah. Christmas one. Yeah, that is which true. Which we never actually did. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, this I mean, is a, like. There, you just need to like shit. do something that really flexes. Yeah, I really gotta like work out that like part of my brain that's like very good at conceptualizing shots and where characters are. I'm just not like a yeah. visualization person. I'm more of like mm-hmm. if you if you give me a task like oh clean up this shot or like grunt work type shit, I might be able to do that like better than yeah. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I it's, mean, I could I could write like a short scene for you to like try and animate. Yeah. If you're if you're interested in that. I also have like stuff like that where it's like really short bits, so like I could definitely animate them. It's just like it's more of like a I'm, I'm lazy. <laughs> like <laughs> I mean, it like I could <laughs> I could I could pay you a bit if you wanted uh to do it. <laughs> Bruh. <laughs> yeah i mean you know anime see the thing is animation is one of those like i like for a time in my life i was really interested in trying into trying to like get into it oh yeah i like i just never i just never really got to that point because it's just like okay you have to draw this it's just like i was watching a like a, a career thing on animation and i was just like it was just like yeah, if you want to like, 
you'll like this if you like drawing the same thing over and over. Uh, but it, it's someone else's thing. Um, yeah. So, yeah, the, the, like that, that was my main thing with film. It's just like, oh, oh, you're gonna die. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, there was a there was a thing that I was gonna say. Yeah, I that was my main kind of reservation about like doing film. It's because, like, if I'm if I'm doing if I'm doing film, it's likely not gonna be my ideas. Oh, okay. Yeah. So I I would probably I would be working on someone else's film. Yeah. And like I personally i fancy the idea of like being like a show writer or showrunner oh yeah um but that's hard and that's like a job that like you have to earn you yeah. have to be like you have to be like in the industry you have to be you have Fuck. to know a shit <laughs> you have to you know have a to shit like, yeah <laughs> sorry you have, to, you have to know a shit ton of people and like actually market yourself for writing or else you're not going to get anywhere cuz nobody's going to yeah. like pay attention really yeah like, that's why i really respect those people that do like really really good short films and then actually end up on like tv like that's why i respect the fuck out of uh owen rogers for getting his show on tv like that's fucking crazy he's on season three now of final space and it's a really good show i have not i've not seen that oh it's really good it's fucking animated it's like he, he put out a pilot on his youtube channel and then fucking Conan was like, "Hey, you want to do this? <laughs> you you want to do this?" And he was like, "Fuck yeah, I want to do this, Conan." I mean, but how do I, I get over like, it? I'm, I'm like really, I'm like I agree. I'm like really impressed with like people like Joss Whedon and oh yeah, <laughs> uh, uh, like Damon Lindoff or some I forget their mm. their name. Um, but basically the showrunner for Lost. Yeah. Um, and even to some, res like, uh, even to, like, some extent, like, I, Rebecca Sugar. Oh, yeah. Uh, she is, like, very, like, she, she can, she can do it. It's just, like, actually writing is pretty, is some, mm. uh, like, is sometimes a bit, eh. Like, basic concepts, she is really good at, like. Yeah, and she's like an artist. I, like, at, I, I, I feel like Rebecca Sugar's more of like an artist and like musician first than a show writer and showrunner. That that's just how I feel. Like she can yeah. she can fucking knock out some storyboards and like do some really good like music stuff. But like, I don't know. Like there was a lot of Steven Universe where I was like, this looks fucking great. This sounds great, but like it just needs a little bit of a bigger push to writing, and it would have been amazing, like much more amazing. Yeah, and I, I'm not. We're not by any extent like professional writers. Oh yeah, no, or we're, we're professional <laughs> critics. Yeah, we're just two guys on the internet who are like, I this show like is good, but like I don't know. Like I I I I, I want to become a writer. Like. I, I've written some things and you were like, oh, this is pretty good. But, like, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, I, I, I like the I like, I like like the concepts that you presented in uh, Space Time. Yeah. Um, just, like, there, there's, like, there are some elements that, like, just kind of need work, like, kind of, like, filling, like, filling out the actual, like, the actual, like, script. Yeah. Like, you... You like some like some of the dialogue just needs to be like worked around a tiny bit. Yeah, and, and that's like it's, everyone has that problem at the beginning. Oh, <laughs> what the fuck happened there? <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I yeah I do need to like make things longer. For me, it's like it's really hard to like keep that steam going, and I think that's why I haven't like, written anything else for the second episode. Yeah, I mean, I I feel the same way about editing. Is it like, once I'm in, like once I have steam going, it's it's fine. I can I can crank things. Yeah, out. I, but that's it, the same. For it me. just takes so long it to get to so that long. point. Hello there. Like, the record like recording of hardcore, that's nothing. It it would the it's main the reason it took it so long. Like, yeah, is because it was just like I don't want to have to edit this again. <sighs> This sir, you, uh, it, I literally had to like, 
like, spend, like, half of my summer just in my room. Oh, my God. Editing. Yeah. Like, it took me so long, and it, like, it, there, it wasn't, like, edit heavy. Like, it, it wasn't, like, it's super, just the, like, It's just the bulk amount of footage that you have to go through. That's the hard then, part about it, and the tedious like shit. And yeah. Anyway, and should, should we, it. should we, like, end off here, like, after we get our, like, little stuff out? Because this is, like, a next big section of the game. <laughs> yeah, all much. right. Sure, 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 sure. But, like, yeah, I, I feel like editing is pretty fucking tedious with that shit. Hey, Max, you know what that was? What was that? That was a Let's Play. What? Oh, shit, my sister just texted me to help carry stuff in. Oh, fuck. Shit. Uh, yeah, yeah. We, we, gotta, we gotta stop the recording. This, fuck. Ah, stop <laughs> That's the ending, man. <laughs>